so with Cat Tailor, uh, different than other Bluetooth devices, uh, you do not bind Cat Tailor. Uh, we think that this is a more reliable model in that uh, there is no need to store binding data. And in the event that when you are bound to something, if you lose the binding data, you cannot find the device. In our situation, there is no binding data. Therefore, you can always find Cat Tailor. Cat Tailor works directly out of the box. So we're launching the Cat Tailor application. We always, uh, every time you launch the application, we put up a little reminder telling the user to pay attention to their surroundings while they're using the application. And then now it is uh, asking all the uh, questions they have to for the uh, interaction with the phone. So we're going to enable access to our location. We're going to allow Cat Taylor to use the location when it's in the background and so forth. And now this uh, turns on the notification so Cat Taylor can notify us uh, optionally uh, when our cat is nearby. Now, if a user has many cat tailors, we recommend that you just start with the one that is closest. All cat tailors are unique, uh, and the uh, iPhone keeps track of which cat tailor is which. So you just go through the process of naming all your cat tailors. In this case, we're naming mittens. And now we're going to take a photo of Mittens. We're going to use the camera. Tell it to use the photo. And then we're saving this. As I said, if you have multiple cat tailors, you go through then and name them all when uh, the cat tailors nearby or when your pet is nearby. Ideally, you do this as soon as you uh, get the cat tailors. And the second one happens to be Leo. And we're going to add a photo for Leo from the gallery. And then we'll save it. On the cat tailors, if you select one, it will tell you the battery level and then also the notifications. So here we're going to set it to nearby. You can do nearby or never. And then we're going to choose a sound. And there's an example of when a notification comes through that your pet is nearby. There you go. Okay. There we go. Oh, don't don't hop down yet. <laughs> yes. This is why we don't use real cats for any of the demonstrations. <laughs> yes, how's it going? You can get your video on there too. All right. Knocked over mittens.